It's Galaxy Note season and this year the best one is the Ultra. Samsung picks things up a bit at uh, the lineup and the one you want in the 2020 is the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. We have it right here. Last year in a one of effort the Samsung put out these Note 10 and Note 10 Plus relatively closely spec where their size was really the key factor for picking one over the other. Not so this time around the Note 20 Ultra and Note 20 and both begin feature parity is out the door in a similar fashion to how the S20 Ultra is above and beyond the S20 Plus only even more so. Bounding on the Note 20 in the S and the Mia isn't what we are here for and we will deal with its shortcomings and limitations when when one shows up at our doorsteps. For now let's focus on the ultras. First appearing on other the S20 ultras, the oversized camera hum makes a return on the Note 20 Ultra. Most of the bytes inside are the same including the main 108 MP camera and the current the ultra wide. But the press control phone uh, the photo that's in the part responsible for the share size of the assembly is now 12 MP. Swapping out the 48 MP unit of the S series 4. Displays nice marriage of the Note style geometry with some high refresh rate coming in from the S20 music box to be made ever better with an adaptive refresh rate adjustment. Oh, and spoiler is the upright as the AMOLED screen, and with this pack we have the um, 6.9 inch quad. It's Galaxy Note season and this year the best one is the Ultra. Samsung picks things up a bit at uh, the lineup and the one you want in the 2020 is the Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. We have it right here. Last year in a one of effort the Samsung put out these Note 10 and Note 10 Plus relatively closely spec where their size was really the key factor for picking one over the other. Not so this time around the Note 20 Ultra and Note 20 and both begin feature parity is out the door in a similar fashion to how the S20 Ultra is above and beyond the S20 Plus only even more so. Bounding on the Note 20 in the S and the Nia isn't what we are here for and we will deal with its shortcomings and limitations when when one shows up at our doorstep. For now let's focus on the ultras. First appearing on other the S20 ultras, the oversized camera hum makes a return on the Note 20 Ultra. Most of the bytes inside are the same including the main 108 MP camera and the 12 MP ultra wide. But the press control phone uh, the photo that's in the part responsible for the share size of the assembly is now 12 MP. Swapping out the 48 MP unit of the S series phone. It displays nice marriage of the new style geometry with some high refresh rate coming in from the S20 is now supposedly made ever better with an adaptive refresh rate adjustment. Oh and spoiler is the upright as the AMOLED screen coming to this pack we have the um, 6.9 inch quad.
features the S Pen printer on the L LED a slightly glossy N20 um, the S Pen print uh, the contrast against the matte material while the side edges of the top surface have strip patterns to allude to the curved display inside as part of the package you will be getting a 25 watt charger that others to usb power delivery with the pps bits of uh, the standard support as well a usb c to c cable is um, included naturally a pair of akg branded in your uh, headphones are in there too if you are not getting a pair of galaxy Buds live as part of some pre-order bundle this being a review unit and not stri strictly a retail ready package it was missing the huge pulse pair as pan tips and the tools for replacing different size of tips for the earbuds were now wear and now here to be found either we can't imagine samsung skipping either of these things and commercially available units will likely have them Come into the design of the Galaxy Note Also, the Galaxy Notes have a interesting design language to set them apart from the main, more mainstream as series um, phones. The Note 20 Ultra has received multiple adapts, the striking sharper corners we have come to expect from the lineup in contrast to the easier on the eyes, more rounded look of the Galaxy S20 Ultra, the uh, evolu uh, evolutionary refinement can be seen when looking at the two notes side by side, the bottom bezels is higher, thinner, the selfie camera cutout is smaller and that's about it. There wasn't much to shave of the older model to begin with. The display remains slightly curved, enough to annoy flat screen diehards and to make the glass protectors a pain to install at best. The Note 20 Ultra is very gorilla glass with this debits offering improvements over the G6, so hopefully screen protectors should be needed shouldn't be nearer, not nearer. Um, having said that the phone does ship with a sheet of the plastic fall for some extra peace of mind. So in the past we have been able to get the official replacement for this. The Note 20 Ultra is not just a Note but also an Ultra and there is no chance you will miss that even at a passing glance at its back a camera assembly so big and prominent we haven't seen before with the Note 20 Ultra now thinner than the S20 Ultra the bump is raised higher out the calipers go and we measure 2.6mm on the Note 2.2mm on the S model Having said that, the design of the Note 20 Ultra's camera cluster is a lot of sophisticated and classier than the S20 Ultra's. For starters, there's no sign for the space on products branding. We still can't fathom how that made a flagship Galaxy in the first place. Otherwise, they return an opening for the press clubs. Press um, has gotten a separate outlet to match the other two, and the three camps uh, cameras have the same brush metal looking on them in a matching color to the phone's paint job. Our review unit in this year's hero color mystery analysis comes with a soft touch mini finish. That's about as slippery as they come, but hey, with the camera on this big, you can use it for extra grip. The greatest upside of the finish is that it's now here, or now here, nearly as accommodating your fingerprints and your mystic bronze not 20 all trouble stay relatively clean. That is not the case where the other two color options must take as they be the promo material, the black and the white variants come with the usual glossy glass. Made or gloss, the back panel of the Note 20 Ultra is made of the biggest too, so at least there is at 
and the Note 20s are IP68 certified as expected.